so I'm back with another, another little rant. This time, I don't know if I've ever talked about stuff like this before, but it's about roadworks. And I don't know about you guys, but in New Zealand, roadworks is literally like second nature. When I tell you that no matter where you go in the country, you'll see tons of road work everywhere multiple times a day slash week you'll probably see the same the same road be worked on for literal weeks months and sometimes even a couple years a couple years at a time road works is literally like it it's just second nature here it's like fucking sheep You'll see sheep so often that you're just like, like, damn. Like, fun fact about New Zealand, sheep's are, like, sheep's have a ratio to four to one. For every foot, like, for every four here. Um, I, I'm just stuttering. For every one human in New Zealand, there's four sheep. And I feel like the ratio to from roads to road work there's about for like every road there's probably about three road works two road works at least i don't know what in the world is going on with road work so much especially in like the new area that i moved to bro i've been seeing road work so often and it's like it's getting bad so where i live i live on a highway and it's a, a highway in the country so when I'm, when I'm like needing to go to work, obviously in the country, I have to go to town in order to, you know, my job, my job's in town. So I have to go to town in order to, you know, do my job, which isn't, you know, that actually isn't that bad. It's only 15 minutes out, super fast, 15, 17 minutes out, super fast. I don't mind at all. The thing that I do mind though, is the road works on it. Like when I when I tell you guys, there is so much road works going on. This I don't understand. I don't understand why there's so much. It takes like the fifteen to seventy minute estimation that I have in my mind to like twenty five to thirty minutes sometimes, especially in the morning. I don't know what it is, but in the morning, it's just terrible. It's just absolutely terrible in the past like couple weeks three weeks i'd say there's been just everything road works crashes so they're closing off the highway so i have to take instead of taking the, the just the straight on path just straight through everything i have to take the long way which is literally going around a mountain and if you guys don't know i don't drive a good car like it's an snt it's a little car bro it just gets banged up and i'm going over a rocky ass mountain if other big, luckily, since I got the small car, I can avoid these other big cars like like all these trucks. Like since they closed off the highway, I was going up, was going up the hill, and coming down was literally a big food delivery truck. So I had to veer to the side in order to get out of the way because there's fucking road roads going on for some for some some shit on the highway. There was some shit like that going on the highway. I don't know what was going on, but oh my god, it's pissing me off, bro. I had to keep rearing to the side because all these big ass trucks coming up this mountain. And my small car that I could easily just be pushed off by. There was that. There's been multiple crashes. People keep crashing on this highway. I don't know how. It's such a straight highway. When I tell you guys, it's literally so straight. There's only a couple corners, and they're big corners. They're not small corners, unless you're speeding way too fast, you should be able to hit these corners easily. I don't know what they're doing. These cousins need to reevaluate how the fuck they're driving, because there's been a, like a fatality or a car crash every week, basically. Just every week. It's just, people just keep, uh, and it's like in the same areas on the highway, so the highway keeps getting blocked off. So we have to keep going around, finding different routes. And then when the car crash situation is finally resolved, another road work starts because for some reason, the roads that we make in New Zealand, 
can't last more than one week without getting fucked. Like this highway, I'm not exaggerating. I am not, I swear I'm not exaggerating. Every week, every week, it's getting worked on. And it's the same three areas on this damn highway. It's always the same. And I'm pretty sure it's the trucks. The trucks are too heavy for the road. Like they're just too heavy. Like they just end up fucking everything and putting potholes in it. And I don't even blame the trucks, right? Because, you know, they need to deliver all our shit. I'm also blaming the fucking... The road people who are laying the roads. What are they using? Like I see in the US, bro, they, you see how much traffic they got? They bring out whole last tanks all the time on their roads. That shit's solid. Bro, you bring you bring over a fucking Salmon van onto the goddamn highway. Oh, fudge, you got a you got a pothole. You got this. You bring over one goddamn truck. Fudge, your shit's broken again now. I think I need to come fix it. Like, piss off, bruh. Why is our road so fucking weak? What do we use? Play-Doh? What are we using? Must be using Play-Doh with some bloody clay, because this shit is trash. This ain't even concrete, bruh. This, this is not weak. I swear we're not using any sort of concrete, bruh. We're just using Play-Doh. There's no way. It breaks every week sad thing it's i'm not even joking it does break every week if not every other and they had to come back lay the same goddamn road i'm like oh my lord and it's annoying because i'm like you guys aren't short of jobs why are you doing a shit job because originally i was like maybe they're doing a shit job so they can always have a job to come back to but then i'm going around like i'm going around my area i'm like bro there's like 50 million jobs there's 50 million jobs around because these are never going to run out of jobs. I don't know what these roads are made out of. To last, like, this long. They just don't last at all. Like, it's not even any better in town as well. Because, like, obviously, in the country, there's a lot of trucks. But even in town, I see so many roadworks. So many potholes everywhere. And it's just normal cars. Like, trucks can only go certain routes. They're too big to go down every road. So they have to take certain routes, so it's not like it's only trucks. It's just, it's literally just the... It's just the road. It's just built poorly. I don't know what they built it upon. What's the foundation for this shit? Because these have so many jobs to do, and I've seen how many jobs they're doing all around the place, so I'm just like, you guys don't need to do a shit job, so you, you know, you'll always have a job. You'll always have a job, trust me. Because these take like four, four months. I remember my my friend. They were, they cut off like a corner to his road, so we'd have to take like a different route in order to get to his house. Right, it was literally only a corner. It was only like maybe let's say twenty meters, twenty, 20 meters of road. They block. Ah, uh, nah. Let's give him. Um, let's give him. 50 meters okay let's give them 50 meters just to give them the benefit of that 50 meters of road they're only doing like maybe 25 30 meters of it and it legit took them four months four long months of them daily being there for it to finally be opened and it might have been longer i just stopped counting after a couple months because he, he went off to he went off to basic training or was it core training it was one of the trainings and by the time he came back they still hadn't fixed it. They still hadn't fixed it by the time we came back. He left and maybe like a week or two after. It was finally done. That took fucking ages. It was literally just a corner. It was just, it was just a corner. No one going over it. Because who could go over it? There's cones and barricades on that shit. No one could go there. And it took them that long to do a corner. That was at most 30, 30 meters. And I'm, and I'm giving them, like, a benefit of the doubt by giving them that much, because I'm pretty sure it was less than that. It took them so long, and I'm like, holy shit, there's so many pieces, like, parts of the road you guys could have gone, could have done. And watch it. It's probably going to end up breaking soon anyway. It's going to break soon, and they're going to need to repair the goddamn road again, like, for the 50th time. I don't understand what New Zealand's using to fix their roads, but 
I think they need a need a use a different material because the shit's not working. I say material like they're gonna use wood or something. They need to use something else though. I don't know what in the world they're using, but you know I'm sick of this clay and play-doh mesh that they have going on. Uh, yeah, I just need them to stop. Comment down below if you guys have like similar problems with like roadworks in your country. I don't know if it's just our country, but bro, our roads are trash. Like there's always roadworks going on. If you ever come to our country, you'll probably be stopped by roadworks at least a good couple times. If you're on like a vacation, you'll be stopped. You'll see roadworks going on everywhere. Highways, cities, little towns. The whole shebang, bro. You can't go anywhere without there being at least some sort of roadwork. Even if it ain't big. But trust me, even if it's like a little ass project, like a little corner, it's going to take the months. So by the time your vacation is done, it's probably still going to be there.